And guys, we got a 2000, uh, it's a 98 Honda Accord from Canada. Blower motor doesn't work. Let's see what we can figure out here. Quickest way to check a blower motor if your plug is accessible. So, verify power on the, uh, the feed wire and ground on the control wire. So first, we'll check for, for that power. So test light connected to that power wire and if it finds a ground, it should light up like that. Okay, and we'll verify a key off. See, there's no power. Key on. So our power feed to our blower motor is fine. What about the control wire? So now, if we ground that control wire with the dash controls here, that test light should come on. So right now we're in off. I turn it to one. Sure enough, it lights up. Two, three, four. So our control is there, but the blower motor doesn't work. So the next quick and dirty test is plug everything back in and then just uh, just tap it. So let's see if we can, if we can do that. So we'll get our test light out of here. Let's see that should be on right now. I'm in two, three, four. Nothing's working. Now the test light, again, we can do <clears throat> So when the blower motor's off, okay, test light connected to battery or uh, just the ground so again we check the feed the feed is good now if that motor if the winding inside is good on the control wire when we're not grounding it we should see 12 volts a test light should light so we come over here no light the winding inside the motor is hitting like a dead spot and it's just not uh, not functional. Now he said sometimes when he slams the door or hits the dash it comes on. Try to get it to work. So I turn the knob on. Nope. <laughs> there you go. Sweet. We got air blowing through our vents. Four, three, two, and one. And off, our test light should light if the windings are intact. And I don't think they are. It's blowing, it's working. So, anyways, bad blower motor confirmed, we're done. What I meant to catch on tape was, the test light is actually, there we go. See it's flickering? Again, connected to negative, so that, that test light is lighting because the current is going through the blower motor windings and uh, finding a ground through the test light as well as through my controls here. So when I turn it off, the test light should stay lit brightly. So here's speed one. You can see how it's flickering. There's a dead spot in that uh, blower motor, you know, in the brushes or the commutator. When I turn it off, if it stays lit, we can restart our blower, so I'll prove that to you. The blower works. Now if it stops on that dead spot, the 
Let's see if we can get it to stop on on the dead spot here. Oh, there you go. So now, when I turn the controls on, the blower motor is not going to come on until I hit it. There you go. Beautiful. Yeah, that's that's quite the confirmation. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. That was a fun one.